Hey everyone, it's PJD here, and today I'm going to start this video off with what I could not fit into the end of the last video, and this is actually a request from a viewer. Um, a long time ago, I showed in one of my haul videos that I purchased a lip butter from the 100% Pure company. I got mine in peach, see the little peach here, and the individual asked that I put the product on my lips, and so I'm going to do that. So you can see, kind of, at least get a feel for how this uh, lip butter applies and all, all that good stuff. Um, I just first want to say that I had already done a review of this on the blog, uh, my blog, productjunkydiva.blogspot.com. I did a text-based post, but um, I'll just talk about it here too quickly. Um, so this particular product I really like because it is a natural product. Um, and for the ingredients in this product, it's 100% natural, but the ingredients in this product are 99% certified organic. And it even lists the associations down here uh, that have certified that the ingredients used in, in this particular lip balm, um, lip butter, are organic. So this one actually uses um, butter, avocado butter, shea butter, uh, cocoa butter, peach flavor, organic pigments of cranberry, strawberry, uh, tomatoes, um, and peach. It has rosehip oil, and that's it. This is, you know, that's how short your ingredients list is when you have natural product. And I will tell you that it smells like one of those fruit roll-ups. If you've ever had a fruit roll-up from fruit roll-up from the health food store, it smells like that. Like it has that really natural kind of scent to it. It, it smells like that. So this is the peach one and it, it looks dark in the little tin, but see, I just put it on my finger. You see just the lightest red pig and i'm going to put it on my lips i'm just showing you this first you get the lightest red sheer tint and when you put this on your lips or kind of move it like this it really goes away so don't look at this deep red color thinking that this is what you will see on your lips you will not i mean you would have to really 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 smack this on in order to to see that happen to see a red sheer tint even because it, it's very thin and it's not pigmented. Uh, also, the other thing I want to say is I would buy this lip butter again and again and again. I'm going to put the price right here because I actually don't remember how much it costs. I think it was like $7 or $8 or, or somewhere around there. But I'll put the price here. But this particular product I would buy again and again because it really is moisturizing. And it, it's not tacky at all. It's not a sticky lip butter. So I really like it. Um, okay, so now I'm just going to put it on my lips. Okay, I have to tell you that I've done probably a million videos taping my mouth and I've never posted them on the blog because the lighting is always horrible. My mouth always looks crooked. I can see it right here and my mouth is not crooked when I look in the mirror, but <sighs> I digress. Anyway, here's the color of the product. I'm going to just do, 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 put some on my finger. Here we go. And dee, 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 dee. Hmm, can't really see the shine, but see my lighting is always gross that's why i never do this but okay can you see the shine maybe a little bit it is shiny though um it's just not showing up well here sorry but it is shiny and oh you can see a little bit of the red tint not too much but you you can get a mm -hmm. yeah see mm -hmm. maybe if i do it at that angle you can kind of get a feel for it but um so that's the product not sticky, not tacky, very nice, mm, very smooth, love it. So that's my lip moisturizer from 100% Pure. I'd buy it any day of the week, good stuff. Okay, so today I'm going to be reviewing the Peppermint Clarifying Shampoo by My Honey Child. I like these cute little um, images she's using now. Anyway, um, as you use moisturizers or heat protectants, whatever products you use, your hair will start to get a little build up and it's good every once in a while to just go through and use a clarifying shampoo that will remove all of the product build up and kind of give you a clean slate. And it's actually, there was a point where my hair had product build up and when I would use the good moisturizers, um, it really wasn't penetrating into my hair because of all of the buildup that I had. So I had to go ahead and do a clarifier. And I can tell you that this peppermint clarifying shampoo really, really did just strip away everything and gave me a clean slate. Uh, this is one of the clarifiers that I use that actually did that. And I was just pleased with it. Uh, I'm just going to read the ingredients. I'll show you a future product coming up for review um, as I read. Organic veggie base, distilled water, organic peppermint leaf infused with olive oil, ginkgo biloba, rosemary leaf extracts, organic sunflower oil, organic babasu seed oil, vitamin B, chamomile, and vitamin E. That's it. 
great clarifier but it is drying so you need to follow up with a moisturizing conditioner for sure um, if you get the eight ounce it's eighteen dollars if you get the six ounce it's twelve dollars I like this clarifier if you have any clarifiers that you think are wonderful please let me know in the past I reviewed the clarifying shampoo from um, hair Veda yeah so anyway that's kind of it but um, I'll talk to you soon bye